as well welcome back to the channel it is sir vance thank you guys so so much for clicking on this video and make sure you like you comment you subscribe you share this video click the notification bell so you can know when i upload something new and today i'm going to be showing you all how i did this beautiful flame sweater yes this is my burn sweater and it's the first in the um the flame series i was doing i have my blue flame sweater i'm going to link it down in the description box as well and we're just going to go get right into the video so i um did this sweater like this edge it just came on a whim and i decided to um do you know a flame sort of series and i started with this sweater and this i i really really enjoyed doing this like the challenge was the challenge of doing this like working with four colors in tapestry was not easy but the challenge like i really enjoyed the challenge so much and okay obviously i started um i started the sweater with the tapestry at the front panel that's what i was going for first because like i was scared i was like if the front panel doesn't turn out right yeah definitely this whole thing is not going to turn out right so i did the front panel first then ended with it like i just ended with the front panel then i moved on to the sleeve so technically i did all the tapestry um first i moved on to the sleeves after the front panel then i completed the sleeves and i completed the um front panel like this wasn't easy this took me so long like i'll be tired then i'll pick it up sometime at night i'm going to wake up sometime in the night then pick it up again so you know start crocheting and it was it was very um, stressful on me it was really stressful on me but i really enjoyed um doing this sweater so when i did um the sleeves and i finished the front panel I just decided that the back panel was going to make it all black because I I was tired okay I was tired and I just like the way it looked with you know just the front panel having all the designs and everything and when I was done I decided to do you know sew everything together I decided to you know stitch it together and I did um the the cuffs the yeah the cuffs I did um the cuffs as the ribbing separately and i got tired i remember i get i remember getting tired when i reached um the neckline of the you know the front panel like i was tired and i decided to make the neckline really big like it was really deep and i just you know covered it up i have a tutorial on my channel on how to um you know adjust a wide neckline so definitely check that out because if you have seen i'm sure uh, i'm sure i have clips on how wide the neckline was it was like really wide but i still made it work which i love a lot so i just stitch everything together then the neckline was the last and when i measured this sweater i decided to make this bucket hat on a whim like i love the way everything is just going so well together so um yeah so definitely check out um the video on my bucket hat on my channel so um i think that's that's basically it and oh also for my blue flame sweater make sure you check it out the sweater and the bucket hat to match and this thing guys these things are on sale also so hit me up in my you know in my social medias then especially on instagram and i will hit you up you know i'm going to let you guys know if they're still available if you want to place a command or something which i will appreciate anyway that's it i decided to make this video short thank you guys so much for watching and supporting me i appreciate it a lot and make sure you leave a comment down in the comment section and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!